What's up guys, Sal here. So remember back in 2015 when OnePlus launched a device called OnePlus X, which was a compact mid-range handset with a ridiculously cheap price of only $249. At $249, the OnePlus X was nothing short of a revelation for mid-tier smartphones in 2015. It didn't have all the bells and whistles as its price would suggest, and the small 5-inch display and infuriating invite system wasn't everyone's cup of tea. But it had a lot of good points, the powerful processing hardware, pure software, AMOLED screen and incredibly nice build quality were all very compelling for that price. OnePlus fans were begging for another groundbreaker like the OnePlus X which proved just how far the boundaries can be pushed on a budget. They want another powerhouse that makes compromises in just the right places to punch well above its price tag. And thankfully it looks like OnePlus might be looking to return back to their wallet friendly ways because according to a tweet by XDA developer Max Weinbach, the company could be looking to revive the OnePlus X series. Apparently OnePlus is looking to revamp the OnePlus X handset and launch it under a new series. Now there's some confusion. According to previous information, there will be three variants in the upcoming OnePlus 8 series and one of them will be OnePlus 8 Lite. That device never had its brand name confirmed, so it seems Max is talking about the OnePlus 8 Lite. In any case, the idea of a cheaper OnePlus phone is a much welcome one, especially in this day and age where seeing more phones enroaching the $1,000 mark, with some even going $1,400. Also, we have a detailed spec sheet of the OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro courtesy of Ishan Agarwal. Much of it we know already, but there are a few things I want to point out. The first one is reverse wireless charging. Earlier, it was said that the OnePlus 8 Pro will have a 30 watts of reverse wireless charging, which seemed too good to be true, and as it turns out, it was. The phone will only have a mere 3 watts of reverse wireless charging, which pretty much makes it useless. The fastest reverse wireless charging solution on the market right now is offered by Xiaomi at 10 watts. Anyway, the good news is, for the first time ever, OnePlus phone will have a wireless charging tech, and in the first try itself, OnePlus is hitting the ball right out of the park because it will have a 30 watts of wireless charging, which is way more than what market leaders like Samsung offer in their $1400 devices. Also, for the first time, OnePlus is offering an official IP rating, but only the Pro Mall will have it, and it's IP68. The battery is seeing an upgrade as well, but it's a mere 500 mAh compared to the previous phone. Considering the OnePlus 8 Pro will have a 120Hz Quad HD Plus display, I'm not too optimistic about how this 4500mAh battery is gonna handle it because my Exynos Galaxy S20 Ultra with 5000mAh battery does a pretty bad job in keeping the device alive for a day of moderate to heavy use. So it will be interesting to see how well OnePlus is gonna optimize the phone. In any case, we're gonna hear quite a lot about this handset in the days to come. So if you wanna keep updated, please be sure to subscribe. And as always, I'll see you tomorrow. Peace out.